So we have a travel day and a half ahead of us. We are currently here in Munich and we are attempting today to make it the whole way up to Hoi An, which is kind of in central Vietnam nearly. But it's gonna be a massive travel journey to get there. To get there, we are getting a sleeper bus and yeah. it pretty much is what it says in the tin. It's sleeper a bus, bus that you sleep on. <laughs> yeah, we got one of them the other day to get here from Ho Chi Minh. And to be honest with you, it was a bit dire. Yeah, it was a bit crap. <laughs> we, we were expecting um, a better standard, but yeah. we think we're unfortunately getting the same bus today. Yeah. So we're not really looking forward to it. So our bus is leaving now at 1 p.m. and we've been told that we could either arrive in Hoi An at either 9.30 a.m. or 4.30 a.m. Bit of a difference. Bit of a time difference there. So we really don't know. This is gonna be a massive journey anyway. It's gonna be at least 13 hours in this bus. So if nothing else, It'll be an interesting journey. And a long day. And a long day. <laughs> okay, but we do need to get going. We're at our hotel now. It is like 12 or just after it, and we have like a 15 minute walk to get there, and we still need snacks from the bus. So let's go. until half one so we have plenty of time we're gonna go out now get some food pick up a few other wee things from the shop for the bus journey and just have a walk around until the bus comes so we've just come off the street and we find this little restaurant we've ordered ourselves a kum tam i'm not too sure if i'm saying that right it's the first time us trying like a vietnamese rice dish we've got rice a fried egg a pork chop some vegetables and sweet chili sauce, so I'm really excited for this. <laughs> Ah, oh, that was so good. Honestly, that breakfast is the best food we've had in quite a while. It felt like so long since we've had like proper good meat and we haven't really had it at all since coming here to Vietnam and even just to have a rice dish as well was so nice. That's our first rice dish here in Vietnam too. So we're proper happy the day's off to a good start. We've just picked ourselves up a few bits of bread out of the bakery to take on the bus. So the day's going good, so I think we're gonna grab a coffee now, head back to get our bags and hopefully then catch the bus. Central stop, I don't know. Coffee, coffee time. Break. <laughs> Coffee's got, let's go. So it actually turns, so loud all the time. So it actually turns out we have to get two buses in order to get to Hoi An. This first bus we're getting is like five, nearly six hours long, we think. And then we make a changeover somewhere. I think we're actually stopping for like dinner because it's such a long journey. And then you make a changeover to another bus to do the whole overnight leg of the journey. So yeah, it's just gonna be a, a long interesting ride. It's so loud. <laughs> Okay, so it is now nearly two o'clock and we are still waiting. So the waiting game continues. Two 
two hours until we stop for dinner somewhere but it is now got dark and they put on these like red and blue lights in the bus I think Ashton's gonna have a wee sleep as well but the journey's going pretty well so far The sunset was so beautiful and the sky's turned like a beautiful colour but it's nice and dark now so I feel like it's time for a nap <laughs> We've arrived! We think! <laughs> We're just packing up. I think we're actually getting... Okay. Oh, yeah, and come on. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Ready to rock? Let's go. Okay, so we have been dropped off at what looks like a bus station kind of thing. It is literally like, I don't know, at the side of the road. We were told when we were booking the bus it would stop somewhere around half six, seven o'clock for lunch or for dinner. And we just assumed there would, there would be like restaurants and stuff around and it looks like there's nothing around. So yeah, not what we thought it was going to be for our pit stop. And nobody's told us anything. We were just told us to get off the bus. So we're just at the side of the road now with a few other people just, I suppose, waiting to be told what our next step is. But yeah, I'm starting to get hungry. So I hope we do find some food. But the first bus wasn't too bad, thankfully. It was actually relatively cozy. So it'll be, it'll be quite interesting to see what the next bus is like because this is the really, really long one that we're going to be on all night. So yeah, we'll just have to wait and find out, I suppose. So we find a lady on the side of the road selling some pot noodles. So that's what dinner is tonight. It's filled us up a little bit, so we can't complain. But we're back at the bus station now. We've made a few friends with the rest of the people on our bus. And we're just waiting for the bus to let us on. So next stop, hopefully Hoi An. He does not look happy. They are not made for long legged people. You're too long. Not <laughs> A much needed piece up. The bus has pulled over and Owen has ran off it. <laughs> You're looking pretty fantastic. You're and those toilets weren't half bad either. So we're gonna hop back on the bus and see how long it's out. I'm not too sure at all. No one's telling us anything, but we're back on. Let's go. Someone must have thought I deserved a pair of shoes. So there is like a full foot section, but I've just filled it with my bag and my shoes. And um, but yeah, it's not bad. Worse. Exactly. Definitely. It could be a lot worse. Exactly. Positivity. <laughs> the bus is actually pretty good. It's not too bumpy, it's too even loud, but it doesn't really matter. And we're sitting up near the front so I can actually see out through the front window as well, which is pretty cool. But we're going to try and get a few hours sleep according to my map, so we should arrive in roughly about another five hours. So we'll have to wait and see for that one. Morning. <laughs> okay, so it is now 5 a.m. in the morning. Way too early for this noise. But yeah, the bus has made a very important pit stop at this filling station to wash the front of the bus. Why? I do not know because it wasn't dirty, it hasn't gone through muck, it is so loud. But for some reason we have stopped here and we've been here now for like 15 minutes and the bus driver's out washing the front of the bus. Very badly needed, very important. But we still have like an hour and a half of the journey so yeah I think it's going to be like half six maybe even after by the time we arrive in Hoi An. But we got a few hours sleep. I did anyway, Ashley's still sleeping so yeah it could be a lot worse anyway. But I think I'm going to get back on the bus now and go for another bit of a sleep because I'm still very, very tired. But yeah, the journey actually hasn't been too bad, thankfully. So yeah. And also whenever you stop at these locations, you get off, you go for a wee pee inside of the road and the hedge or just somewhere. But they give you like these wee shoes as well. A couple of wee pairs of sliders, yeah, yeah. They literally set a big massive basket off them like right outside the bus door. And whenever you step off the bus, you slip straight into these. And then when you're getting back in the bus, you have to put them back in the basket because you're not allowed to wear any shoes inside. And if you do wear your own shoes, they were like shouting people for wearing their own shoes and their own sliders as well. So nice to be extra touch there as well. But yeah, I'm going back to sleep. <laughs> See you in Hoi An. 
Still sleeping. <laughs> wakey wakey. Morning. We have arrived. At the side of the road. Woo! In Yay! <laughs> it wasn't too bad. I am ready. I'm ready to get off. <laughs> yeah, you got a good sleep though. Yeah. Let's go. Oh, thank you so much. Oh, England. <laughs> Irish. <laughs> oh, camera. <laughs> Bye, boss. <laughs> Everything. Let's go. That way. Just here? Yeah. Oh, yes. Oh, thank okay. you. Yes. Oh. <laughs> okay, thank you. A little bit further. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> we made it to bed. Oh, the hotel let us check in like super early. It's now like quarter past 20 past seven nearly and they've let us check in so we are so so happy but it's time for sleeping yeah. <laughs> it's time for sleeping what it's, a long travel yeah. day slash night so yeah we're gonna call it a day here call it a day the day hasn't even started call it a yeah, nap <laughs> call it a nap we're gonna go for a few hours sleep and then go explore high on so can't wait to go out and explore the city thank you so much for watching I hope you enjoyed coming along on our bit of a mad long crazy travel day on a stupid big crazy sleeper bus. And hopefully on our next video we'll be a wee bit more enthusiastic. Yeah. <laughs> See you later lads. Bye bye. bye, -bye. <laughs>